Hi, it's Rob here, and once again I'm looking at Video Booth, that's on the right hand side of your screen, and uh, a, a new, well, it's not that new, but it's the first time I've spoken about it, um, a new piece of software uh, here, uh, which is AV Web Webcam Morpher. Now, it can be fairly dodgy on my system, I don't know about yours, but it has some interesting effects and uh, again the whole point of this is to demonstrate what you can do on the cheap in terms of video effects so rather than lashing out a lot of money on proven robust solid dependable products instead let's uh, sort of make a hash of things and put things together in a, a loose arrangement which sometimes works but gives you a lot of fun in in the um, pursuit of graphic godliness anyway here we go AV webcam morpher let's see if it's uh, responding you can see I've got the amorpha on it has settings which um, dare I press the settings I don't know sometimes it works it works you can adjust those settings and perhaps my XP system with 4 gig of RAM is just not up to the task but there you go the mirror function is on you can turn it off invert is now off uh, funnel float is now off so we've got Soliton, Twister and Amorpha running at the moment. And on the right hand side in Video Booth, the trial version, we've got a range to pick from. This one looks the most interesting. Now you can see if you were creating some interesting um, images for your, perhaps you were doing some VJing or you just want uh, to jazz up a video with some interesting effects, uh, you could le easily run your video through this and chain together some quite unique effects. Now I'm sure you could do this in a lot of very high-end products and even mid-range products uh, and possibly uh, do it easier but you wouldn't do it any cheaper. Um, so moving right along let's try a few more combinations in video booth. That's interesting enough. Kind of get the the uh, idea here. I hope. As I say, Video Booth provides a free trial version, and it does have some interesting uh, functionality. Now you could take screenshots of this if you wanted some graphic artwork to then work on in uh, Photoshop or whatever your graphic uh, or illustration program might be but uh, you could also make short video loops and uh, they're quite interesting run your own images through this and you can use video booths uh, supplied backgrounds but possibly uh, possibly not they're not to my taste, but there you go. That's the most interesting one there, I should think. We might play with Soliton if the AV webcam morpher will play with us. And you can see some quite interesting combinations that you can get happening here. Twister. quite like that. In fact I could probably watch this for hours and bore you to tears and of course YouTube wouldn't uh, host it but uh, you can get the idea. Now my system is uh, lagging a bit. This is a bit uh, of an ask for it. It's not the latest processor and it doesn't have maximum RAM 
but uh, we'll press on. Flying objects is an interesting one. And settings. Increase the count and the scale. Now I think you're getting the idea now of what you can do if you just feed uh, one effect system, uh, in, in this case AV Webcam Morpher, into Video Booth. And we can go further, Landscape. And we've probably pushed it a little bit too far. Yep, it's still there.